Oh my goodness. Make it part of me, I will be the Black Lotus. I will be you are what you eat. Yes, I will become Black Lotus. Yeah. Yes. And I will become Black Lotus. That needs to be an unstable card. Like, there's Black Lotus, Blacker Lotus, and Unglued or Unhinged. What would Blacker Lotus the, be? And then the bigger Blacker Lotus <laughs> for the Cards Against Humanity joke. Oh, oh wow. wow. What would the Blacker Lotus be? Yeah. It, it's just called Blacker Lotus. What, what, what would Black, Blacker Lotus do? Oh, it makes four mana, but you have to tear it up. Like, you use it one time, basically. And it's done. It is done. Uh, Five, six, seven. Yeah. Wait, need to determine who's gonna go first. Um, that's a good question. Oh, here we go. Alright. Roll. No, that's just one. Hey, hey, looks like you got it. I'll take Anyone play. Chicken the deck I'm looking at is oh, about. Well, oh, there's the line. And something broke on the line. I'll keep it. Likewise. I'll keep it. It's a Alrighty, I'm gonna yeah. play Windswept Teeth, crack a lacket. Alright. I'm gonna get a Temple Garden. I'm gonna play a Noble Hierarch. Noble's good. Alright. Oh, okay. And. The one I've got is the Paradoxal Storm. Pass so I didn't yeah. say yeah. drop all your. Okay. I just only did yeah. This one right here. Alright. It runs. It does run. Well. It runs Jason, it runs Sculptor. Yes. Well, this one is Marsh Flats. Okay. We're going to get a Swamp. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. basic spell. Yep. Uh, yep. Pick them back up, draw that many cards, drop them back out again. So I'm gonna bolt the bird, also known <laughs> as Bird yeah. Push. I don't want to box anyone and play. My dad always said I was always like, uh, it took me a while to figure out. Yeah. And there it is. Okay. And then I'll pass the turn. Because like, we have I have like three elves built. I just need to buy uh, and, uh, it's to that one cradle. Hi, Vizier. Yeah, I need uh, one volume and a bad one. I didn't hate it. But when they yeah. moved me, and then uh, uh, So you're a little bit cheesy. May I see your. It's yeah. a forest <laughs> and temple card. The one cradle yeah. that I have. Okay. Is uh, uh, fetch. Heavily played. We're going to get <laughs> an island. Play. So I, mean, I managed to I get it for 100. So I sat down and thought about it. So, uh, I was like, I don't know if I'm going to sell for Bayou, the still player. Give me. And I'm going to cast Spreading Seas, targeting your Temple Guard. You know what Spreading Seas does? Uh, it becomes an island. Yep. You got it. Give me just a quick <laughs> sec. Two and a half boxes of the Temple Guard. And it's now an island. Yep. It's just good. And then, um, pass turn. Yeah, that'll do it. Yeah. Is this legacy you haven't managed? Yeah. yeah. I think he's building it. He built some. Uh, it's just kind of messy. If you want to, you can just cut around the edges first. That might make it a bit easier. Go to combat. Three yes. Two. Take two. Pass turn. It's a little weird to me that a vizier. Of remedies, a medicine person, a doctor, a nurse, or something like that, has a higher power than toughness. What on earth? Yeah, I guess that's a little odd, isn't it? A loaded. Why? Yeah. He's been trying to sell, but he's got his own. Because the other ladies are even. You need all. Well, it's in the maybe it's in the flavor text. You you'll need all your strength for the trials to come. Yeah, That's why it has crater. Oh, yeah, yeah, I guess. I guess. Uh, I'm going to thought seeds you. No. You don't have to. I don't have to, but. Witness cord, witness collected. That stuff. So whatever I take is coming back. That said. I think I still have to make you do it. We're going to make you take uh, collect a competition. Yeah. And then we had good salt spells. And then they it wasn't the Belcher business. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. Cyborg Belcher, so he traded in the Belcher for Game 2. It was the pitch my dad. Get my dark and and I'm guessing he probably had a bunch of ones, which allowed him to flash it's, back. And it's still good. Fetch. Yeah. Get so yeah. a fetch. Get a watery grave. Yes. So There's a lot of mayhem. Mayhem. Can't draw card. I win. It's it's fun to <laughs> watch. <laughs> but he goes <laughs> like. No, really another legacy really deck that, that I saw that looks interesting is Void Hell. Where it's basically you have no graveyard. Alright. 
mill until you hit something other, but it's not going to be great for our Period. Mm -hmm. Tasker leaving. Imperial Painter. But so Fatal push. Okay. Yes. Pass turn. Pass turn. Well, we might not see this deck's namesake. Oh, yeah. What is going on? Okay. Four. Four. Uh, three and four, yeah, I'll take it. Pass turn. Yep. And after that, I just kept I'm going to crack it in response. Shadow Doubt. Players can't search their libraries this turn. Draw a card. Stone Rain. That is pretty hardcore. It is. That is hardcore. I'm going to combat swing for two. Uh, Fatal Fish. That was the top deck. Pass turn. That's pretty good. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, that just... That did it right there. So yeah. I was about to e-witness. Four? Yeah. Um, pass turn. All right. Pass turn. End of turn. We'll do this. Uh, Tasker's ability. Put the top two in. It's a Liliana and Hallowed Fountain. So, which non land would you like to give me back? Which non land? To Push's Shadow Lily. Um, I guess I'll give you a push. Alright. Yeah, that's, that's never a spot to be in. Alright. Um, no, I'm ready. Alright, five. Nice turn. Jay, I want see how you do that shit. One at a time. I've got a question for you. Brain. One and one. E witness. Um. Results. Okay. Get so back over tomorrow. Court the company. Yeah. Okay. They finally fixed my schedule. Pass turn. Yes, that's right. End of turn. I'm good to go for the next three weeks. Please. Push it. Push it real good. Did you lose? Did you? A swap. Because that's the push he gave me back. Okay, it's a three three per mana. Oh no no no! You're right. You're right. Okay okay. I'm sorry. That's good. Do you have anything fetch for? No, I, I don't right now. How many lands do you have? Uh, four. So I could tech edge to turn it on. Um, You'd have to. It has to be I think one you control. Yeah. Uh, so I could yeah. sack a tech edge. Oh, okay, yeah yeah. There to you do go. that. Um, which is exactly what we're going to do okay. here. We're gonna. Uh, sacrifice Tech Edge, destroying Horizon Canopy, yeah. and then we'll Fatal Push it, and then on my turn we're going to swing. And I'm dead. Uh, so, let's try that again. Game two. So here we go. I just get, it's weight. I think it just weighs what's recently sold heavier. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think market price is the six most recent sales of a given card. Uh, average together, if I remember. So that simply putting a card on the market doesn't change the mean. Um, and therefore change the value of a card too much. Okay, I'll take the play. All right. All right. And I'll keep this. Likewise. Yeah. And I have premium effects. Oh, here comes a ley line. Double ley line. Double, okay. Yeah. And... Um, pass turn. All right. <coughs> I like the Castlevania music in the background. Swamp. <coughs> Cage. Pass turn. 
<laughs> that does things. Yeah. That does bad things. Yeah. The squatch. Okay. Pastor. Uh, yeah, that's not Blue Delta Fetch. Okay. 17. This is main board, by the way. I mean, yeah. Is. In today's meta, I think that's fine. Hello, yes. Fountain. Okay. May I see your lands again? <laughs> hmm. Uh, spreading seas your forest. And then, fast turn. I can lift the bottom of the bike. You do it on my own? Yes. Okay. Um, this is another thing that used to do it. Okay. Um, you can go to combat, swing for two. 15. Then why not? Play a vizier. Vizier? Okay. Pass turn. Spring season's bad. Mm. Yeah, it's, it's a card. It's, uh, it's real. Pass turn. Did you cast anything? No. I, I'm all up. Mm hmm. Seems good. I'm going to go to combat. I'm going to swing for five. I'm going to push it. Yes. Go for two. Yeah. Take two. Pass turn. Uh, we were increasing the number of players you, when you're controlling the game, when you can gain a lot, you can control the whole game. Yeah, that's why I'm going to play this way. Soul Sister Killer. Pass turn. Busier? Oh, hi. Okay. Go to combat. Swing for two. Here we go. Pass turn. Polluted Delta. <laughs> Fetch. Go to eight. God the Shrine. <laughs> there you go. Knight of Souls Betrayal. Creatures get minus one, minus one. Hmm. <coughs> that does it. Yeah. Okay. Um, past turn. Pass turn. Let's see. Illegal. Illegal. Yeah, Souls betrayal is good. Yeah. Yeah, it is. For four, it's kind of still stinks. Um, all creatures. Liliana of the Veil, yeah. all hail. Okay. Uh, let's each discard a card. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> let's discard the cards we can't use. <laughs> and then I'll pass the turn. Pass turn. Get the Undertale music in the background there. He's locking me out. I'm pretty hardcore. We're going to fetch. Go to seven, get a planes. 
And while I'm searching, yeah, that card doesn't work. What is it? it? There's a card in here that awkwardly has the word target in its text. It doesn't seem like it should, but it does. <laughs> What the hell do you think the whole box is? Right. Uh, plus? No, I mean, I didn't know yep. you were discarding card. Discard card. <laughs> okay. Sounds good. And burial. <laughs> and then, uh, pass turn. Come on. Jeez. Pass turn back. Oh, okay. And this game is over. You got three cards, two cards my hand I can't use. Yeah, I'm going three cards. Can I do this when I get picked? Oh, yeah. You let me do it a lot, though. So you knew, like, I was in there all the time. Pastor? I just worked with English. I'm going to fetch while you're doing that. Go to six. Yeah. Getting a Hallowed Fountain tapped. We try to help. Out there. Or, uh, excuse me, getting a water grave tapped. I already have a hallowed tap. Where'd you go? Hey. Point. I'll pass turn. Well, just shy. <laughs> um, I'm gonna be a jerk. Yeah. Unfortunately. So, uh, uh, spreading seize my other one. Gonna spreading seize the other one. You know it. Seems good. <laughs> I'll pass the turn. Pass the turn. <laughs> It's rough. It's rough. It gets worse. Scarab God. Yeah. Alright. So, what creatures do you have in your graveyard? I have Duskwatch, two Viziers. Duskwatch and two Viziers. Okay. Well, that's somewhat easy, I think. Okay. It doesn't matter, I can't get creatures out of your grave. Um, I can exile a target creature and that creates a token. It doesn't actually reanimate it, so we are good. Um, so, Graft Diggers, Cage, Creature Cards, can't. Creatures can't enter the battlefield from graveyards gotcha. or libraries, so yes. technically that doesn't enter, and if he dies, he doesn't come back to the field, he comes back to my hand, so. Okay. Yeah. Um. Yeah, pass turn. Oh, it's a four-four, by the way. Nice. Yes. <laughs> Seems good. Pass turn. I don't think you plus Lily last turn. No, I did not. Uh, swing four. Yeah, we got it. All right, pass turn. I got lands in here, man. Yeah. Somewhere. Eight. All right, pass turn. Uh, end of turn. We're going to uh, anim we're going to take both of your viziers uh, using Scarab God's ability. Exile target creature from uh, graveyard. Create a token that's a copy of it, except it's a 4-4 black zombie. I'm going to pay two life. Oh, no! Oh! My target vizier? Yeah. Yeah. And I'm just going to exile these two. Okay. So the correct way for me to word what I just did is doing it one at a time, so that if he responds with the surgical, I can instead say dusk watch. Uh, you want to switch that up? And it doesn't matter. In a, I mean, that makes sense. That would, yeah. That's how it should play. So you pick one at a time. Fair enough. So you want to get the dusk watch? Thing? I'll get the dusk watch then. Um, yeah, I'll it's, still, I'll still get both it's a token, but you know, whatever. <laughs> yeah. It's excellent. I, just, so I just pour it out. I don't know, that's what I've been doing. Now, just to make sure I understand, at the beginning of each upkeep, if no spells were cast last turn, you do not cast any spells, I do not cast any spells, this baby's about to flip. So, uh, triggers, we're going to let you flip first, Okay. and then uh, scry, 
It's still a four four though, right? Yeah. It, well, yeah. This is still. Or is a four, it four, does, does, it to, does it flip to be a three three? It flips to be. That's a good question. Um, I think it's now a 3-3 that's a 2-2 because of Knight of Souls Betrayal. Okay. I think it's now a 2-2. Yeah. Correct me if I'm wrong, YouTube. I, I think that seems right. But, but I think, yeah. And then we'll scry one from <coughs> Scare of God because I have one zombie. And I lose life. And you lose one life, yeah. Oh, God. Um, this is not how the deck's supposed to do it, but we're going to do it. Um, yeah, we'll keep it on top and draw. And I think I might even have you this turn. Uh, somehow. Yeah, we have to do it that way. Okay, um, Elishnor. Oof. Yeah? Does that. Alright, so you're six. You're, well, yeah, yeah. So actually, no, we, we don't have you this turn. Um, swing, at, swing at you with ten. For ten, yep. Yeah. If this were a 5-5 five five instead, we'd be okay. If this were not a 3-3, three three, but were a 4-4... Four four, yeah. Oh, no, no, never mind. Never mind. Yeah, okay. we, needed, we needed more than that. But, uh, yeah, all your creatures get minus 3, minus 3. Because I'm a jerk. And then, pass turn. It's pretty... <laughs> it's really jerky. Yeah, the Scarab God, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Doesn't really do much more for me. No. It can get you one card deeper, but yeah, unless you cast that card off blue, I can't cast any anything. May I ask what your hand looks like? Yeah, yeah. It's a bunch of stuff I can't do. Oh, it's anymore. Scooz, Druid, Dead. Noble, Spirit, Dead. Noble, Dust Watch. Yeah. Everything dies. Everything dies. I should have done something different. Uh, yeah, Fiddle push wrath. Yeah, good yeah, That's pretty good. So the way this is supposed to work, you see the Umboreal Rites, you see the Elish Norn, it's a gifts deck. Yeah. And gifts is a little interesting because gifts has target on it. So when you cast the, when you play the ley line, I have its target opponent chooses too. So I can't play gifts uh, against you anymore. So I was off the gifts reanimator plan. And I just had to sort of scare God you out. It worked. It it worked somehow. Yeah. The uh, night of uh, whatever betrayal there. Yeah, it's a it's a silly sideboard Souls card. Souls betrayal. Oh, did good. That and then else more combined. That just ends it. <laughs> this is insult to injury. I I've never cast this. Th I don't think I've ever hard cast Elish Norn prior to this game. It's always coming off of something silly like Reanimator Show and Teller. You know, something like that. So that was hardcore. Yeah. In hindsight, I should have... I brought in um, some graveyard hate. Sure. And I feel like that was probably a good play, but yours is not really... You're not really going, like, deep into the graveyard. You're, I mean... Yeah. I did bring in some graveyard hate, but... I mean, that's probably... It probably could have worked. The deck doesn't need it, but a little graveyard hate's fine. It actually stops, for a little while, the Unburial Rites plan. Yeah. Um... I would need to scare a guy to reanimate after <coughs> when burial rights fails. Uh, other card, uh, cards I cited, there's another Graft Digger's Cage, and then yeah. there's one more. I, no, no, that was it. That was actually it. Graft Digger's hurts. Yeah. And I should have anticipated it, Graft Digger's Cage. I took out Lingering Souls, because yeah. of Knight, Knight of Souls Betrayal, and this I don't think is a great match for it. Um, yeah, it does. One ones can eat your creatures. They can trade with your creatures, but your creatures combo me instead. Yeah. Uh, and then collective brutality was a little awkward because again, I can kill your creatures with it and maybe take a collective company or something. But for the cards that I'm bringing in, this just locks you. These just mu lock you much harder. Uh, so that's why I went that way. I took that out. Yeah, selfless spirit. So I feel, actually, I feel like. I feel like in hindsight, like that's not a bad thing to take out because you you had all that kind of universal board effects going on. Yeah, so I it wouldn't have really saved me. Wrath of God was in my hand there at the end. It's a uh, one Wrath of God, one Damnation, one Supreme Verdict. Wouldn't do anything on Barter and Blood, but a lot of gifts decks will run at least three Wraths so that they can gifts and choose four Wraths, yeah. like three or four Wraths, and then you have to give them at least one. Um, that's something that you'll, they'll find. So, for example, Gifts Ungiven, Wrath of God, Damnation, Day of Judgment, Barter, and Blood. Give me two. 
yeah. and that's uh, that's brutal to a lot of fair creature decks. But yeah, that's this. That's how it goes. So you should definitely play this, I would think, and play play against like four more decks. Yes, and then put it on as a series. That would be pretty neat.